Go on and get out of here. I love you, Johnny K. You're speaking a foreign language to me now, lady. Now get the fuck out of here. And this other guy runs out of the shop, pushes me over and says something like, you forget thousands of things every day. You make sure this is one of them. That was pretty scary. Back to you in the studio. You want to get lit now, sugar? Tre Trevor, baby, you want to you wanna smoke up now? Don't do it, Johnny. Don't do it. Trevor! You been with my girl again? I'm speaking with you, asshole. Don't do it, Johnny. I told him, Trevor. I told him. We all get high. We all get high. But that don't Leave make it, it right. Johnny. Leave it. The crystal has got us, babe, but that don't make it right. Don't make nothing right. Not what you've done with me. I'm telling Johnny, leave it. I ain't leaving nothing. Trevor, I'm talking to you, motherfucker. Are you? What are you saying? Fucking my girl, man. It's wrong. Well, I gotta fuck someone. You want me to fuck you instead? I is that the problem here? Take off your pants, cowboy. All right, let's let's fuck. You think this is funny? Get them off! I told him to leave it, Trevor. I told him. Leave it. Leave it. Shut up, Ron. I'm about to fuck me a meth head, ain't I, cowboy? Get my boy sucked from his toothless gums, huh? Fuck you, Trevor. Oh. I still love her. All right, cowboy. Hey, I know. Hey, come on. Shh. I don't mean nothing by it, man. I just... I know. I messed up. I know, cowboy. It's okay, man. Give me a hug, yeah. Fucking shit! Cut! 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 Who the fuck are you speaking to? Who? Who? I'm talking to you, huh? You fuck! Johnny! Huh? Next time, don't get in my fucking face! I just saw a fucking ghost and I gotta hear your crap! Get up! Get up! Fuck you then! Johnny! Wait! <laughs> You seen Ashley? Johnny's looking for. Her. Well, you know, as a matter of fact, I just did just ten minutes ago. Yeah, I saw her on the end of this penis here. Uh, Johnny ain't gonna be cool if you mess him with her again. Oh, really? Well, you don't think so, huh? Well, why don't we just ask him then, huh? Hey, hey, cowboy, you mind that I fucked your old lady? Sorry. What was that? Well, no, 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 you don't mind? Oh, because you're a dead man? And the only sentient part you left is this little bit of brain and the gristle on the end of my boot? Well, thank you very much, cowboy. Bullshit! Oh, I like it, denial. That is first part of the grieving process, brothers. Now let's all hold hands, huh? Oh, looks like you got something you want to say, huh? You got something you need to say? This better be bullshit. Oh, where are you guys going, huh? Let's go, ladies. If that van takes us back to the camp, this area ain't gonna have a biker problem much longer. You got him! Yeah. Who makes the set? I do work. Next, I'll have this thing so far up your ass, your tonsils will be playing shadow puppets. You think we can't do that? We can. It's in our guidelines. I don't know what you're talking about. I install cinema equipment, not surveillance. Grab his other arm. No, 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 no. You think you're impenetrable? See how you feel when this is 18 inches deep inside. No. What the fuck is this? Terminate him. Close this problem right now. Yeah, I can use a little backup here. Excuse me? I didn't give you a free pass to act like an asshole. You're bringing a lot of heat. Hang out with bad people, doing bad things, making idiot moves. I'm an idiot. I move. True. But the last thing I need is you getting caught. Why? Because I lead them to you in some plea bargain thing? To me? Who am I? There's a hundred guys in this building alone who fit my description. Middle-aged men, paunchy, glasses. You bring them here? 
What's this? Empty office? Leased to a man who died in the last days of Vietnam? Ooh. Call me up. Huh. My number never existed. No, I'm not too worried about that. I mean... Put the weapons down, boys! Fun time is over! We've got you! Anti-American activity! Put your weapons down, all of you! Who the fuck are you with? With me! You fucking rat, I knew you didn't have the balls for this! For the record, I'm a patriot! I love my country! Put the weapons down! Fuck you! We all know you agency boys are ball deep in a plot to drive up your funding by any means necessary! Boys, the gun down, gentlemen! Who the fuck are they? Fucking Merriweather! What are they doing here? Steve, put your gun down! Oh, same goddamn leg! Go! Fuck! Bullshit! Club ain't open, Snowbird. Who's this jackass? Hey, you! Oh, turns out these guys are in love with their contract. So they'll be going back to the set with me. Can you believe this fucking clown? No! This guy's all mine! <laughs> There's a real physicality to him. Ah. <clears throat> Make a new deal. You leave my people alone, and I don't toss you off this roof. All right, yeah. Okay, sure, man, sure. All right. Set some fat fucking old jackass on me, please. Big man. Oof. We had a deal. We had paperwork. Hey. Fuck off, Johnny. Hey, you're a couple real fat asses. Put a beat down on an old man. Hey, we don't take that. We have a deal hey. with them. Just about. Please, get those millennial ass wipes. A pleasure. You fuck what? Where you going, tough guys? I thought you were a tough guy. How you like me now? Coming up, this is your chance to get a good shot of her. Man, you're not the one hanging out this fucking trunk. You people are stuck. Man, it's gonna get worse before it get better. Whoa, whoa! What the hell, man? That motherfucker's right on top of us, dog. I'm taking a sharp right. Keep that camera on her. I'm gonna go left and cut across the intersection. Hold on! Yeah, fuck you too, man. You have no idea what I'm capable of! Move! Come on, man! Hit the gas! This crazy-ass bitch! Ah, oh, shit! We got traffic ahead! Going left! Keep it steady! I will fucking destroy you! And everyone who knows you! Jesus, she's still on us! Screw this! I'm going through the construction site!
want to be like you. Alan Parsons Project. If I might you. It's not a semi. Nigel! John! No. You won't believe what's happened! What? Only Al Dinapoli walking. He actually walks! He walks walk among, among us. us! Well, then what are you freaks waiting for? Well, that's a long story. Of mistaken identity. And a lot of lies. Stalking is not what I would call it. Oh, me! I told the judge I thought it was unfair. Yes, anyone's trousers could have come undone at that point. Exactly. Jolly bad luck. And we were such fans. If only we could talk to him. Yes, I know it was only his lawyers and agents. They ruin everything. If we could only get him somewhere private. You see, like that little lockup I know. No problemo. Look, there he is! Oh, shit. It's that crazy English bitch again. Nigel, he remembers me! To the chariot! Jock, you drive. Quick, he's getting away! Come on, Jock, get in! He's taking a left turn down the high street, Jock! Seems rude not to follow him through the window. Bloody hell! That's a thrill! Ah, uh, would you like me to escort your guest of honor to the trunk? Well, if you don't mind. Oh, come here, you! Come on! Come on! Let me meet your biggest fan! Oh, ah. no. You're fucking crazy! Oh, it's Get all off me! <laughs> You're good to go! Ah, a true gentleman. This is so exciting! Nut jobs. Oh, he's making such a fuss, these celebs. Oh, they're not like you or me. Ah, ah apart from you, Jock. <laughs> Would you go and get him one of his favorite pizzas? No. Well, then I don't know what to do with him. I mean, he hasn't eaten for a few days. You've kidnapped a major movie star, okay? Now, you can either leave him somewhere and hope he's been sufficiently scared shitless to stay quiet, or you can send him on the kind of trip he won't come back from. Oh, a trip! Such fun! Oh dear, oh dear, what a palaver this is! Decisions, decisions! If you could just handle this, Jock... Al is in the boot of the car. You'd be doing us such a favor. I'm really not one for goodbye. I don't see this car here. Anything. And why are you doing this? Well, one, I'm a bad person. Two, I understand that love takes many forms. And three, most importantly, you've seen all our faces. Well, here we are, Al. Curtains up. It's time for your final scene. Well, here we are, Al. Curtains up. It's time for your final scene. Jock, we've been worried sick. I regret to report the sad passing of Mr. L. Danopoli. Train accident. Very sudden. I loved that man. We will remember him always. The way he was on TV before we met him. Not that any of us met him, of course. You two enjoy the rest of your vacation. Oh, there he is. Mr. Fucking Crazy Man. You want a beer? No. Good. Because I ain't fucking got none. Very funny. Maybe if being a drunkard doesn't work out, you can be a comedian. Fuck off. <laughs> and you, Kate, fuck off out of here. Hey, bro, can you get us out of here? 
On your knees, and stay down till we're gone. Good, kid. You're good, kid. Let's lose this heat. Marvel's full recognize! What the hell was that? I said I had a score. I didn't say I thought of everything. Well, well you could have thought of something. A car? Everyone in this shithole city's got a, a car. Go back to Liberty City, you Irish prick. You know where we'd be if this guy hadn't come along? We wouldn't be sharing the take is where we'd be. We'd be sharing a jail cell. You know, I ran big time hoods in LC. We took major scores. You can't even handle a drugstore? Oh, you and your stories. Shut up about LC. Shut up about the bank job and your family and your friends. I don't care. So at least I know I ain't the least competent crook in the city. I swear, it's just this guy. Look, man, can you just lose the cops? This kid's all right. Drop us around the corner, we'll give you your cut. Hey, look, uh, I know I seem like a hothead and an idiot. I am a hothead and a bit of an idiot, but I work, okay? And I can handle myself. I ran with some big guys in LC, and the only guy I know over here is him. If you ever hear of something, a score that needs bodies, would you think of me? All right, dude. If someone were to mention something like that, I got you. There's your share, bro. Think of me. Packy McCreary of Duke's LC. Hey, mister. Yes? Hey, mister. You got, got some junk? No. Shit. Come on, do you know you want a tasty burger? I'm really starting to Jones pretty bad. Hello? Kiflum, you have come this far, but the journey has only just begun. You've waited years for this moment. You're exactly in the right place. I was lost. I sold myself. I took drugs. I was in conflict. Then I discovered an incredible truth, a truth so incredible that if I told it to you now, you would melt into nothingness. You are ready, but you are not ready. Oh, I'm not ready. Then you're ready. I don't know about that. <laughs> the truth is incredible if you're capable of understanding it. We have your email address. We will send you an incredible education tool that will help you to unlock the secrets of the existence. That will cost as little as five thousand dollars. Five thousand? What price would you put on having the tools to understanding everything and to achieving the impossible? The price I would put on that is every penny you've ever earned. <laughs> Kiflin, sister mother. Well, the price I would put on it is all the money in the entire world, because that is how much it is worth. Well, we're offering you millions of dollars of top-quality research and learning by society's best thinkers for only $5,000. Think about it, Michael. And if you think too long, we know you're not ready. Kiflam. Kiflam! Okay. We're winners, man! Fucking winners! That's how we roll, brother! Bling! Check! Bodies! Check! <laughs> Paper! Check! That's how we roll, bitches! The boss! Are you alright? Too much booze jerk testosterone up the ass? Uh, fuck you! Fuck you, man! Well, you know who I am. B to the K to the butts. <laughs> 
Oh, yeah. I'm off getting laid, probably, so call back another time, and yes, she is a lucky lady. Yo, good to see y'all. I'm out, over from LC, looking after these joints. You taking over this clubhouse? All right, all right. I guess you're gonna be starting some kind of MC chapter of your own? This got all the recreational facilities your crew gonna want. Darts, juke, arm wrestling table, working bar, whatever, whatever. Yo, you gotta invite some prospects, get them to join the club, then you lay down the hierarchy. You usually need like a VP, a road captain, a sergeant at arms, definitely an enforcer, you know, something like that. Each role got its own perks and its own responsibilities. Hey, it's good to keep shit organized, cause there's jobs out there folks will pay an OMC to do. Get them out of trouble with the 5-0, run protection, make hits, you know, whatever. Work goes up on the board and you can take it if you want it. Your friend's here. All right, thank God. Brilliant. That's a wrap. Piss off, Laszlo. What? This is a nightclub. This live version of an awful TV show is not happening. Not, not, but Tony... Oh, but Tony, please, nothing. We have a new landlord. We're going back to what we do best. Playing loud music, encouraging awful behavior, dancing until dawn, and having personal crises like good, God-fearing idiots. <laughs> Tony, please, I'm desperate. <laughs> Listen, I love narcissism. I built a career on narcissism. I stare into the mirror and beat off like a real man. I pose, I preen, but there's a limit here. I cannot, I will not sit here and watch it. We need kids, young people, midlife crisis divorcees, whoever's gonna bring the party. And we need them wasted and we need them dancing. Not taking selfies with some fuckwits. I ran the fucking 1980s. I was the 1990s. And I'm back. Okay. Get me a DJ! But, Tony, I, I'm the DJ. <laughs> I'm the, no, you're not a fucking DJ. You're a dick. Uh, a dick? But, uh, Tony, I got you a bunch of celebs. I'm gay Tony. The gay Tony. I'm the celebrity here. Me and him. But if you want to bring some famous people into the club, we will host them gracefully. 